Well, good morning, everybody. It is Monday, March 13th. I'm Maggie Fleckno, and this is Houston Happens. I know we're a little bit sluggish with that time change, but guess what? We are going to get you going on this Monday. We have a great show in store from the Oscars to the start of the big dance and some Monday motivation. We've got something truly for everyone. So what do you say? Let's get this show started. And I'm pretty excited, you guys, because I have some big news to share. So I have to say it was a busy weekend for my family. We celebrated my husband's birthday and it was a party. There he is with our sweet May. Look at this cake I baked. Yes, I bake everyone's birthday cake. And this year I made a vanilla cake with some chocolate frosting, but our little cupcake there, she was definitely cuter than the cake. But yes, we had an above par birthday for my husband. Went out to dinner with my parents and then we had a family day at Pop Stroke. Now, if you haven't been, I really recommend it. It's out in Katy and there are two 18 hole Tiger Woods designed putting courses. And I decided, as you can see there, to play with May strapped on me. She's already over 13 pounds. Let me tell you though, I played the best putt putt of my life, folks. I got a hole in one there. You see it right there. I have never been so excited. Clearly May is my good luck charm. My dad, I was telling him today, I was so excited. He's like, well, it's because you kept your head down. And I guess I did because I was looking at May. But either way, I got a hole in one and it was a great time celebrating our favorite guy. And he's really lucky because it's the best time of year for a fella. Madness is in the March air with selection Sunday setting up the tourney and all roads as we know are leading to Houston. Speaking of which the Cougs are the number one seed in the Midwest region. They went 31 and three but are coming off a loss to Memphis in the double AC championship game. And can we trust them to make a deep run in our bracket? Well, here to break it all down is my good friend, digital producer Chad Washington. All right, Chad, what do you think about Houston? I know they played without their number one player. What are you, how are you feeling? I'm feel, still feeling good. I mean, Marcus Sasser got hurt on Saturday, hurt his groin, but he said, hey, I'm still going to play. I'm ready to go. I'm going to play in a tournament. And plus, they're playing Northern Kentucky on Thursday. First round game, Northern Kentucky, not a real challenge for this team. I'm going to say it out loud. Yeah, no, that's good. No, but so they can probably rest him, but they're going to need him on Saturday against either Iowa or Auburn. So he's going to have to be ready for that game. So that gives him about maybe a week. But I'm I'm going to guess that he's going to be ready by that time for them to make this push. But he's got to be healthy if, if the Cougars are going to try and make it to the energy. Stadium. And we have a lot of Texas teams oh, in this bracket. Wow, My husband's this... excited. The Aggies against your team. Oh, that's right. This is a we're very biased here because <laughs> You got Texas A&M facing Penn State, which is, I'm a Penn State alum, so it's going to be a little personal. I'm going to get a lot of heat from the Aggie fans, but boy, this is a very good matchup, though, for that. So, the first round matchup, because A&M likes to pound it down low. They got a lot of big guys. Meanwhile, Penn State relies on the threes, but it's going to be really interesting to see. Meanwhile, you know, but, you know, we, it's a lot of teams are going to match up, and a lot of the first four seeds are obviously going to be a lot of attention on them. Uh, Alabama's a number one seed. Kansas the number one seed, also Purdue a number one seed. We know Adam. Adam, over here is I be think more Purdue. Pitching on them. Yep, He's we got be him. On them, but you gotta keep an eye on the Aggies, though. They're gonna be one of those teams to keep an eye out on the, in, in that in that region for U of H, and that's another thing too in that Midwest region. Like we said, Texas teams. Not only you got that, you also got the Longhorns as a two seed, uh -huh. and that's a team that's really dangerous because they're playing really on the high. They won the Big Twelve tournament. Uh, beating Kansas so really keep an eye on those Longhorns and so that's going to be a team to really to look out for if you're the Cougars. Well I see you're already getting that bracket ready in fact are you guys getting your brackets ready because we have a bracket challenge in case you didn't know so tell everybody where they go Chad. Go to CW39.com click on the little contest link right there and it'll take you right down to the basketball challenge fill it out fill out your brackets Tell me who you're going to pick, and you're going to go against not just me. You're going to go against Maggie. <laughs> Maggie's going to make her picks eventually. I am. I already have my like my whole team. Thing. Yeah, she's going, to, she's going to make her picks, and we'll see how it goes. And we're going to see how how it goes. And whoever comes out on top or for you guys, you're going to win a $250 gift card, and that's some big money there. That's good. Something, Dollars make you holler. I'm just saying. A little, a little something, a little reward. And you know what I love? 
you're going to keep coming on my show to talk about this. Oh, Chad and I talk oh, sports every morning while we get our coffee and oh, I get my tea. This is, this is going to be a fun tournament, and this is going to be fun, especially with all these Texas teams. And um, hopefully we're going to see some Texas teams here at NRG Stadium, preferably a team wearing red and, red and white. I would like that. I mean, um, it's set up for them. Can yeah. they handle the pressure? I although, don't know. Although secretly I prefer a team wearing blue and white for Pennsylvania to get here. And I prefer maroon because I live with an Aggie. <laughs> but no, we just are excited that all this madness is here as always slam dunk my friend love my chad you know what else you can get a slam dunk when it comes to saving money on your electric bill check out the mvp power wizard new year new rates when it comes to our electricity bills sometimes you just don't know what type of plan to find for you well guess what we have our good friends at power wizard joining us christine thanks so much for waking up with us thanks for having me so christine i have to say it's been great to see my bill and see the rates start to go down what kind of trends have you been seeing yeah so we at power wizard we're constantly looking at market trends forecast and while we don't know what's going to happen in the future we're definitely seeing rates come down right now However, most people a year ago signed up on this long-term contract. Um, so, and rates are definitely starting to come down even further. So talking about those long-term contracts, should we still go on a long-term contract? I mean, the 12 year or 12 month, I should say, it's kind of appealing again. So what do we do? Yeah, if your contract is um, ending anytime soon, now is really the perfect time to switch. Um, seeing rates at 10 and 11 cents again, and even with 12 month contracts, so you can actually sign up for a shorter term plan at this moment. Okay, but here's the great thing, is you guys will guide us and you'll help us find the right plan for us. So tell us a little bit about the workings of Power Wizard. Yeah, so we're constantly looking at trends. Um, what we do for our customers is sign them up on their behalf. You never have to lift a finger. Um, we'll sign you up for a new contract and we'll cancel your old expensive service. Um, so we literally do it all for you. That's what I love because, girl, I don't know about you, but breaking up is hard to do. And you're like, oh, I don't want to have to call someone and be yeah. like, yeah, I want to get out of this. Yeah. And you guys will tell us then you'll just switch our plan automatically. Absolutely. We'll call them for you. If you call them, they're going to try and get you to stick with the same contract. Um, and typically it's super expensive. So most people just continue on with their service because they don't know what to do. That's what I did. When I was in my apartment, I just kept auto renewing. And yeah. now looking back at my bills. So I don't know about you, a lot of New Year's <laughs> resolutions you want to save money and yeah. power wizard that's what you guys are about and customers they are happy you guys have amazing reviews we do so we have hundreds of five-star Google reviews and we plan to keep it that way so so what's the best way for us to get in touch with you all just give us a call um, that's really the easiest way our customer care team can give you a um, updated contract rate and really let you know how much you can save each month that's what I love too is that you actually have people there because so often you can't get a hold of a person you have people there that will answer the phone we and do. it helps every demographic we so do. the elderly too they really benefit from this too yeah we encourage you to call us rather than go online it's just so much easier that way you get to speak to a friendly customer care expert. Hey, that sounds like heaven to me. <laughs> well, Power Wizard, what are you waiting for? They are here to help you find the perfect rate and save you money. Sounds like a good deal to me. Thanks so much, Christine. Thank you. You can't escape justice. She was going to get me. What'd you do? I hear <laughs> Judge Mattis. Next on CW39 Houston. We're here with Chris Cunahan of our local leaf filter. Tell us how leaf filter is different from every other gutter protection on the market. With Leaf Filter's patented filter technology, there are no gaps, no openings, no place for debris to get in at all. We install Leaf Filter on your existing gutters. You'll never have to climb a ladder to clean out your gutters again. You know, that's peace of mind and then some. So how do people sign up? Well, folks in the greater Houston area, call 346-501-4701 or visit noclogs.com. Anyway! 104.1 KRBE. Home of the Rulin Riot Show. Morning, 6 to 10. This is where Houston's hit music lives. Alexa, play KRBE. Houston's number one hit music station. 104.1 KRBE. Three parks, one spring break pass. Just $79.99.
Whether you're riding our trains, braving our coasters, or soaring on our Ferris wheels, there's adventure for everyone. One pass to the Downtown Aquarium, Kima Boardwalk, and Galveston Island Pleasure Pier. Buy your pass online now. Whether you're signing up for Medicare for the first time or looking for a plan that provides the coverage, benefits, and savings you really need, I've got exciting news for you. Kelsey Care Advantage is the local plan that gives you more. While original Medicare covers hospital and medical insurance, Kelsey Care Advantage covers prescription drugs, comprehensive dental, vision and hearing, over the counter allowances, worldwide emergency care, and much more all at no additional cost. Speaking of costs, how about zero cost for monthly premiums, primary care copays, and drug deductibles? Best of all, you can see any doctor even out of our network. No wonder we're ranked Texas' best Medicare Advantage plan. Get more without paying more. Enroll in Kelsey Care Advantage today. Call 713-442-7924. That's 713-442-7924. Well, welcome back. A lot of people will be traveling to H-Town for the final four. It's also spring break. Now, while prices for flights, hotels, and rental cars are all up across the board, demand for travel doesn't seem to be slowing. So joining us now to discuss is Senior Vice President and Financial Health Expert from Affirm, Katrina Holt. Thanks so much for waking up with us. Oh, thank you so much for having me. So you guys just did a recent survey. What did it reveal about traveler trends and preferences this year? Yeah, we found that despite record high costs, people are still eager to get out and travel. The average American plans to take at least three trips this year and spend over $3,000. We even found that with millennials and Gen Z, three and four are planning to take up six trips this year. Now, do you have any advice to help travelers navigate higher costs in 2023? I know I still want to go on a vacation. <laughs> Absolutely. I have three tips for you. Number one, set a budget. In our survey, we found that nearly one in five plan to travel this year without setting a budget beforehand. This can easily lead to overspending. When creating a budget, consider accommodations, meals, transportation, and shopping. And then number two, use a transparent, flexible pay over time option like a firm to spread out your costs and stick to that budget. And then number three, watch out for gimmicks that come with travel credit cards. Two things that I just really want to highlight when it comes to flight and hotel credit cards. One, the early sign up bonuses that might be enticing but can easily lead to overspending to try to hit those minimums. And then number two, 0% APR credit card promotions come with what's called deferred interest and end up with a surprise balloon payment down the line. Oh, thank you for bringing that to our attention. Like they say, if it's too good to be true, it probably is too good to be mm -hmm. true. Now, what are some other findings from your recent survey? We also find that it found that is another big year for weddings. The average American was invited to three weddings this year, and they plan to spend an average of $1,000 per wedding. So we recommend adding a line item for weddings in your budget as well. Luckily, I don't have any of those to go to, and I already got married, so that one is done. But where can people go for more information? Yeah, they just need to check out Affirm.com or download the Affirm app to learn more. I really appreciate you taking the time to speak with us this morning. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you so much. You too. So did you guys also catch the Oscars last night? Personally, don't hate, but I was not impressed, especially with that champagne carpet. By the end, it was more like a dirty mar martini, honey. And I found them personally a bit dull. I miss the way the Oscars used to be. But I will say there were some iconic moments. So our friend Sam Rubin has more from the Dolby Theater about the All-Star Night. Check it out. Sunday night at the Oscars, the presumptive winners turned into the real winners as one film had a particularly good evening. Welcome to the 95th Oscars. 
They came in with the most nominations and everything everywhere all at once. Came out with the most Oscar wins, seven in all, including three of the four major acting awards, along with Best Director and Best Picture. And the Oscar goes to everything, everywhere, all at once. Good luck started early in the Oscar telecast with Best Supporting Actor awarded to a very emotional Ki Hu Kwan. My mom is 84 years old and she's at home watching. Mom, I just want an Oscar. We had a good feeling about Jamie Lee Curtis on the Oscar champagne carpet before the telecast began. It's going to be a very good night for the film. It's going to be a good night for you. It's going to be a good it's night. It's a good night for film. Mm. It's a night of celebrating the movies. It's our movie, their movie. It doesn't matter. It's movies. Those good feelings translated into great results. And the Oscar goes to Jamie Lee Curtis. To all of the people who have supported the genre movies that I have made for all these years, the thousands and hundreds of thousands of people. We just won an Oscar together. And my mother and my father were both nominated for Oscars in different categories. I just won an Oscar. Michelle Yeoh also taking home Oscar gold as best leading actress. For all the little boys and girls who look like me watching tonight, <laughs> this is a beacon of hope and possibilities. This is proof that dreams dream big and dreams do come true. And ladies, don't let anybody tell you you are ever past your prime. Never give up. The two Daniels will each need new bookshelves as the co-writers and directors, as well as Best Picture producers, now take home three Oscars each. Um, but I have great faith in our stories. Story, these stories have changed my life, and um, they've done that for generations, and I know that we'll get through this. Um, have a great night, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Everyone have a good night. Thank you for watching. In other categories, in a very tough two-man race for Best Actor, experience trumped youth as Brendan Fraser, who wore his heart on his sleeve all award season, bested Elvis star Austin Butler for Fraser's work in The Whale. I thank the Academy for this honor and for our studio, A24, for making such a bold film. The cast of Everything Everywhere All at Once told me they have rented a party bus, and, well, they've got an awful lot to celebrate. Reporting from the Oscars, I'm Sam Rubin. Love it. Thank you, Sam. Well, now it is time for some Motivational Monday. Now, if you're looking to buy your first home, we know it can be overwhelming, but we actually have someone here to help. Joining me is good friend of the show and leading real estate agent, Nicole Noel, I should say, Collier, who is hosting a free home buying seminar for first-time home buyers. Thanks yes. so much for waking up with us, Noel. You're welcome, Maggie. Thank you so much for having us. It is so important for our clients or future home buyers to be prepared. And so we're going to prepare them and teach them what their credit score needs to look like, how much money they need to have, which is not a lot, by the way. You don't need $20,000 to purchase a home. Really, with a 580 credit score and probably about $5,000, we can get you into a home. Really? Yes. Because really. I know a lot of people stress, and that when we bought our house, it was a stressful process. Yes. So what would you say is the biggest mistake people make? The biggest mistake that people make is, again, thinking that they have to have it all together, if you will, and not really having a plan in place. Mm -hmm. And so that's what we're doing at this home buyer seminar. No matter if you're looking to buy it right away or if you're looking to buy it at the end of the year, we have to plan and put a plan in place for you because everyone's situation is different. Yes, very mm -hmm. much so. Yes. And here's the thing. What are some of the trends that you're seeing? Because I know it's been up and down. Sometimes yeah. they're like buy, sell. What yes. would you say is going on? I always say that the best time to buy and sell is when you're ready. Mm -hmm. However, we are in a buyer's market. And so what that means is that our buyers have the leverage right now. So probably the last 10 clients that we closed on, we were able to get all of their closing costs paid and their interest rate points bought down. Really? Yes. This is amazing. And you actually help a lot of women. Yes. Why would you say it's harder for women? I would say it's harder for women, Maggie, because I think it's women, right? We think that we have to have a partner in order to pursue a, a, a home, right, or to purchase a home. Purchasing a home, a home ownership is the first step into wealth building. You don't need a man to build wealth, honey. That's right, girl. <laughs> this is what I love, some girl power yes, here. Yes. So you help 
everybody. Yes. Again, tell though, we have a full screen too. Let's show about this seminar because it's really important. Yes, yeah, so we're going to be hosting on Saturday. It's going to be over in the gallery area. So it's going to be April 1st, Saturday, April 1st, not this Saturday, guys, 11 to 1 p.m. And they have to register in order to attend because we want to make sure that we have enough resources for everyone. And where can we yes. go though if we want to just use you too as a right. realtor? Sell with Noel.com. All right. Well, thank you so much. As always, it's a pleasure to have you on, my friend. Thank you, Maggie. Stay tuned. We have plenty of Houston happen after the break. Danny, Danny, Danny. The Rooms to Go anniversary sale is here, and we're turning up the savings to a whole new level. With amazing sale prices on the hottest pieces and coolest packages store-wide. Now who doesn't like the sound of that? Whether you shop online or in-store, make your move this month and celebrate in style. It's the Rooms to Go anniversary sale going on now. Age comes with wisdom, and wisdom comes with benefits. So if you have Medicare and Medicaid, or you receive extra help paying for prescriptions, make the wise call and dial 1-855-945-0578 today. Let me help you with that. Cigna Medicare Advantage plans offer a monthly allowance to buy groceries, help paying for essential utilities like gas, electric, water, and more, and up to $20,000 in covered dental services, plus hearing, vision, and an over-the-counter allowance all in one plan. Heidi, I found a better brush for you. Again, if you have Medicare and Medicaid or you receive extra help paying for prescriptions, call 1-855-945-0578. That number again is 1-855-945-0578. To learn more about Cigna Medicare Advantage plans today. When I saw my son take his first steps, I knew it's time to take first steps of my own. I chose a new career in the medical field and the College of Healthcare Professions. CHCP has fully online or on-campus classes that meet just two days a week. So I could work while in school. Start a rewarding career in as little as nine months. CHCP is known for student support and job placement assistance. Nicely done. Take your first step. Visit chcp.edu today for the career of your life. To the tooth grinders, the ice chewers, and the bottle openers. You are welcome here. At Jefferson Dental and Orthodontics, we get it. Life happens, and your teeth take a beating. We're here to meet you where you are. Which means creating payment plans that work with your budget, whether you're insured or not. At Jefferson Dental and Orthodontics, all smiles are welcome here. Not just the perfect ones. Call 800-714-9040 to schedule your appointment today. If you've been injured in an accident and would like to know the value of your case, it's easy. Go to ForThePeople.com and go to Verdicts and Settlements to see cases just like yours. You see, all lawyers are not the same. Morgan & Morgan, For The People. <laughs> and before we get to our next guest, here is a look at today's sponsored content. And it's March, so we continue to celebrate Women's History Month. We're giving the spotlight to a Houston woman-owned business, Kiki Mats. Joining me today is Miss Ebony Roberts. Thanks so yes. much for waking up with us. Thanks for having me. I'm excited because we were talking and I said, I can't stand those basic doormats. <laughs> and you're like, yes. girl, there's nothing basic at all about my business. Nothing. So tell me a little bit about your business. So Kiki Mats is a custom doormat company. We specialize in custom mats, obviously. And we host paint and sip parties, and we allow you to let your doormat do the talking. So you can set the whole vibe for your home and let people know how you feel at your front door with your doormat. I love that. Don't let everybody walk all over you, right? As no. a woman. <laughs> exactly. So, can we show this? Can we yes. hold this one up? So this one says Black Girl Magic. Mm -hmm. I love that. And there's a lot I would want to say. And you hate. Can you do like your friends? Can you do a party? Or of how's course. that work? I have a studio on Houston Avenue where you can come. You and your friends. Y'all can paint a doormat. I have a lot of different designs you can choose from. Or you can do custom. And it's a good time. It's like a paint sip. I love this. How did you come up with this? 
I literally couldn't find a doormat that I liked, so I created them. And I created one for myself, honestly. And then people kept asking, so I turned it into like a side hustle. And then my side hustle turned into now a business, my full-time job. <laughs> this is amazing. So for all of the women out there on this Monday Motivation, what would you say to them if they have, you know, an idea for a business? I would say go after it, just go for it. If you have a vision and it's sitting inside of you, you have to let it out. It's there for a reason. And what has been the biggest challenge you faced, would you say? The biggest challenge was probably COVID. Um, mm -hmm. I had to stop doing my mat parties in person, so I had to switch over to like virtual. Uh -huh. So that was challenging at first, but it ended up giving me a new element to my business. So now, like if you're in LA and you want to paint mats with me, I can do it virtually. I love that. What would you say is the best selling mat that you have? Um, the best selling is probably one that says check energy before you come in this house. <laughs> okay, I love that because I uh -huh. don't want any, I'm very protective yes. of my energy in our space. Like yes. I don't want people coming in my house. I love that. As you should be. So where can we go to sign up to paint a mat or to get one? Can we pre-purchase one? Yes, yeah, so kickingmats.com is where you can get a custom mat either created by us or you can come in and create it at our studio by yourself on our website. I absolutely love this. I want to check this out. I think it's great too because before you know it, it's going to be Mother's Day. Yeah. You might as well. You could do one for every single holiday. Yeah, we're doing a Mother's Day event where you can come like paint with your mother, like kids and a whole family event. So we have some really? things planned out. Yes. I love that and I love a good theme party too. Me too. <laughs> this <laughs> is so much fun. So definitely, thank you so much, Ebony. Thank you have you. that black girl magic for sure. Let's hold this up one more time. Kiki Mats, you got to check it out. I know I definitely do not want one of those basic hats. <laughs> I was with you, girl. I was with you. Well, that is a wrap on today's show. Time flies when you're having fun, but yes. we will be back here tomorrow morning, same place, same time, for more Houston Happens. It's going to be Tasty Tuesday. You don't want to miss what we're serving up. We have a lot headed your way. In the meantime, have a great rest of your day. Bye for now, everybody. Thank you again. I appreciate you. Thank you for having me.